Hi guys, it's Claire, and since Vaughn requested it, I'm going to do it. At first, I was going to start out with Lottie Dee Doll, and then I showed him my display yesterday, my new one. And he was like, oh, I didn't know that dog came out. Came out, yeah, I wanted to do that first, and I was like, oh, okay, so I decided to actually do it first. So, yeah, a lot of you guys have seen this in the toy fair so who knows you guys may not have known that it came out yet but this little playset thingy gardenia magic garden floors little playset when I first seen this on eBay I told myself that I have to get it so I got it in Florida I got it at a Walmart, and literally when we went to that Walmart the day before, hunting for dolls, and this wasn't there, and then we went back the next day to that same Walmart, and there were two there, so I picked this cutesy little girl up. She was $20, and her sticker is messed up. Okay, so let's get into it. This is Flora and Flora's cute little face and the little bow in her hair and then her outfit which is like a pink like a pink sleeved shirt with a green tank top on it tucked into a belt and then these then this cute little skirt and these shoes so you can see sort of kind of how she's locked in there it's plastic galore and then over here's a little that's a little cup a little chair and a little tiny key cup then over here's a table a cup and a little pitcher glass and then behind Flora is a fountain and the Lilo, even though the Lilo should be blue. And then it says right here, play in the garden with Flora, add water to open magic Lilo plant, removable Kiko inside. Which would imply that Kiko is actually in the plant, but he's not, he's right there. And then this is a whole entire backdrop of gardenia and this little tiny platform. And then these little flowers right here that Flora looks like she's standing in. Gardenia Magic Garden. Nine pieces in the morning. And then Flora's Season 5 2D picture. Jack specific and then the Nickelodeon logo going across it and then here's the Nickelodeon logo and it goes all the way across it and then she has a little flower that's probably gone here's a little flower thingy it's a little it's raised slightly than the tab that I hold all my things on. The funny thing about this is my mom said, you are the only person in the world who cares about these tabs. And I was like, yeah, I hang my dolls off them, so I have to care at some point or to some extent. So yeah, this is a little ringlet thingy that this thing does. And then here's a side view. You can see all the plastic that holds everything together. So, I wish you guys luck getting this thing out of the box. And then here is the top view. See, it's a little outwards. And then here's the other view of it and then we get on to the back 
It says play with Laura in the garden to add water to open magically the plant. And then it just has this thing right here that shows Laura and then all the stuff that comes inside the box. Oh, and here it is, removable Kika inside. Which once again implies that Kika's actually in the plant, but he's not. But I guess you can put him in the plant. I don't know. And then here's Flora's 3D image again. I like this image. I think it's really cute. The magic is in you. And then all the copyright information. It's up to the Winks Club to make sure the magical Lilo plant doesn't get into the wrong hands or it will destroy all the magic on Earth. Then Winks logo. Tab thingy. And then contains one doll with fashion, one Kika figure, one table, one chair, one pitcher, two cups, one fountain, and Lilo plant on a garden base. I couldn't read that camera because it was blurry. So, yeah. This is the back of it. So... Yeah, this is this thing. Um, I guess I'm gonna start with my wing stall and then I'm gonna go over to my la -di da dolls and then Twilight, Monster High, then finish off with Bratz. I couldn't remember. They're all sitting in a box that is like over that way. Well, technically it's over there. So, yeah. Um, I think I want to say one line here. Uh, me and Bon Skype last night. It was probably a good, at least a hour and a half conversation it kept on going in and out but it was probably a little over two hours i enjoyed it and i feel that it brought us a lot closer together like in the friend so it's not supposed to be like oh yes he's my friend but i've never seen him so yeah and so that is that and I'm really happy to have Skyped with him, and I can't wait till I can Skype with him again in, like, three days. And why three days? Because my thing doesn't have unlimited internet, which sucks, but it's, like, I have to live within the boundaries of it, I guess. Um, the only thing I've changed display-wise is my week's display back there. And I still haven't gone around doing my Twilight anime display yet. I don't have shelves for any of the other stuff, so, yeah, that's that. So, I hope you all enjoyed this review on Gardenia Magic Garden Little Laura's figurine set, and I hope that they come out with more of these, because if they do, I will buy them. So, yes. Bye, everyone, and I hope you all have a good day, weekend, whatever. <laughs>